Hey you guys, I'm here with Wayne Salento and you are the director of this show, Dancing. You were in the original production of Dancing. Tell me, what has it been like bringing this show back to life, back to Broadway? Very exciting, very nerve-wracking, um, scary as hell, <laughs> but i um, so happy and so excited to do it. Yes. Um, it's an honor to, to get his work back up and to get it in a way that it's relevant to a new generation. And my, the, the film that keeps rolling around in my head is, how would he do it? Yeah. What would he be doing yeah. with the technology? And now there's all of these amazing projections and lighting and techniques and different ways of doing stuff. And what would he have done? Yes. So I'm kind of exploring all that to try to live up to his expectation. Yes, yeah, so you worked with Bob Fosse when you were in the show. What was he like? Tell me his process. Tell me what he would have said about this show today. Ah, God, that's a loaded question. Yeah. I'm hoping he would love it. Mm -hmm. um, uh, you know, he was a very quiet director, choreographer. He was into himself. He put his head down a lot, never really looked at himself in the mirror, wore a hat, and he kind of worked out his choreography. And you can tell by his posture a lot of what his style is. Yeah. So, um, and I used to watch him, and he was quiet. And, you know, he taught the steps, and then his associates and assistants, you know, taught it to the company. And he kind of gave notes and watched but pretty much he was a very generous director choreographer, which kind of left the individual their own opportunity to bring themselves into the work. Mm -hmm. And I think if we were on the right path, and I feel like I was because I never really heard from him. Yeah. So I thought, well, that must be a good sign. Yeah. Um, he's not hating anything. And, um, and I think, you know, along the way, you just get comfortable in the process and respect the man and... That's what I did. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, there are 22 fantastic dancers in this show. What was it like choosing these dancers and working with these dancers to make the show come to Broadway? Um, it was, first of all, it was great finding them. I mean, we went through like 700 people. Um, and then you just, you know, you look at the room and there's a process and there's a lot of people auditioning and for some reason your eye goes to individuals on the floor and you go with your instinct and you take them. And then uh, this, this company is just so eclectic and so incredibly talented. Um, it's just a joy to watch them. Mm -hmm. um, so I, I guess that was my method of yeah. finding people and I think Bob did the same thing. He went for individual people that had something to offer. Yeah, yeah. so years ago when you were in this original production, did you ever think that years later you would bring this show back to life and bring it back to Broadway and honor Bob Fosse in this way? No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not at all. Not at all. It had, like around four years ago, um, I was approached, uh, Nicole, his daughter, was trying to get a, a a remake of the show and she's been trying for a long time and going through a series of different people and obviously it didn't work out and I said I would be interested in doing something like this I never really thought about it but then I started thinking about it um, and trying to figure out how to present it and how to approach it as a director and changing order of events and how it would flow and you know the whole process yeah um, and then I got psyched. I was like so psyched to do yeah. it because I, I, I kind of like saw a path and I was like, yes, this needs to happen. Mm -hmm. um, and I just kind of went for it. Yeah. Yeah. And I mean, here we are, Broadway. Here we are, dancing. Dancing. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You guys opened this Sunday. Yeah. What has been your favorite moment or memory from Pasadena Playhouse to here or just in general? Um, I think the favorite moment is watching this new group of dancers kind of take on his steps and, and like get it in their bodies and, and know what they're doing as dancers more so than just steps, but kind of like have a motivation of why yeah. it's happening and hoping, hopefully Bob is passing through them mm -hmm. and they have a different experience yeah. of just learning who the man was. Hopefully the audience will go, wow. That's an incredible man. Yes. Yeah. 
Lastly, I have to know, if we're able to do it sitting, what is your favorite Fosse move? And then I'm, I'm going to try to replicate it, too. <laughs> yes. Um, there's this thing where he does this roll of his shoulders. Okay. Bop, bop. Bop, bop. Yeah, exactly. And bop, then, bop. you know, he does stuff like that and around. And it's attitude. Go, you go. You're going to be in this show. I should be in this show. <laughs> Pass me. Thank you so much.